Hello gang, welcome to the channel and I just woke up here in Greece, it's like 7 in the morning and the live stream was like 3 hours ago, 4 uh, in the morning on Greece, so I woke up to go to my job and I saved myself live stream to see it right now with you and react on the new stuff we're going to get, I have no idea, I haven't watched it yet and I wanna go through all the live stream with you and see what's going on but yeah before we go through that i want you to make sure that you are subscribed to the channel you have smashed the like button and of course comment down below in the comments your opinion about the live stream i was really hyped from the day we saw that we we're going to get an up uh, a live stream uh, because it's the second live stream in a row i think it was one previously uh, with uh, the Swords and Gardens of the Galaxy, if I'm remembering right. And now, back to back, we're getting another one. And so hyped. I feel like I want so badly the guy to perform better, you know, for himself and deliver better the content. Uh, but yeah, whatever. I'm really hyped. Okay, it starts, it starts, it starts. <laughs> Okay, it's the sneak peek with the two spider ones that make perfect sense now that I have seen the movie. Cheers. Oh my god, it's like I am a kid all over again and I just woke up and went in front of the TV, you know, like when I was 10 years old and waiting. Oh, 3RL. Your angel. It's good to be back. And of course, I'm going to have you I'm super excited to present June's Marvel Future Fight update. Now, what does it mean to be a hero? To live a life full of sacrifice? Countless okay. spider heroes have encountered tragedy and hard truths facing this question. This month's update takes inspiration from Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. Yeah! Spider heroes from across the Spider-Verse are joining Marvel Future Fight. There's a web full of spider people joining the fight. Heroes will face off against Spot, whose evil plans have eclipsed your average villain of the week with a new canon level threat to the entire Spider-Verse. Check out this new supervillain and all the changes to your favorite superheroes with the June update. But before we head into the action, please note that the footage presented today is running on a test build inside of a test environment. There will be differences with what you experience in the live build. We, of course, have also prepared a gift for each She's who watch the live way build better the prepared. So now, let's get into the action. And yeah, Spot was awesome in the movie. In the end, he was not the weekly villain. He was really badass in the end. Oh my god, he looks so dope. Miguel O'Hara looks dope, bro. Oh, he came out of a spot. Whoa, his animation, bro. Spot's animation. Hey, we have the next generation Spider-Man, Miles Morales, who gained a T4 advancement in a new uniform in order to take on the huge responsibility of saving the uh, multiverse. <laughs> Many improvements have been made with his new uniform. Miles' new leader skill affects, has effects that buff his abilities, and if his powerful bioelectricity and spider web attacks have become even stronger. Let's check out some of those real quick. Okay. Electric webs. We call from help from superheroes like Spider-Man 2099, Spider-Gwen, or Spider-Woman, as they will show up randomly to help him in battle using his fifth active skill. Let's go ahead and check nice. those skills out in action. Oh, Webby, oh my god, spray effect. Oh, that uh, was really nice. So first up, we have swing attack. Swing attack applies web to all enemies. Nice. Some lightning damage. I hope this webbing having ignore on immunity like Spider-Man. Next up, we have Agile Strike. Another web skill. Timer still 
with a hit on it. Nice. Will cause web and silence as well as uh, lightning damage. And next up we have Bio Venom Strike. Okay, the electricity thing. Alright, one more time. G uh, it feels Bio like gives him accumulation. And increase all basic attacks and defense, speed and crit rate. Oh, it's a Berserk buff, okay. A Berserk buff then. Number four is Venom Shock. Okay. Venom Shock will stun, remove active buff, and, pre and paralyze, and applies itself a, a chance to grant all damage immunity. Oh, and okay. So he has a PvP power. skill also, fourth skill. We talked about earlier, skill five, Spider Invasion. Let's see who pops in for us. It looks like we got Spider Gwen popping in. Oh. And Spider Gwen was with Spider white Spider uniform. Invasion. Applies web, fracture. Decreases all basic oh, you defense. can't really w see here, but Gwen feels like got a new uniform. Let's go ahead and real quick check out some dev recommended combos. The dev recommends three, five, and four. And we'll go ahead and just do a quick preview. Don't have to worry about messing up the combo myself. Okay. You can check out the other combos in the preview menu. I can't wait to see how Miles will write his own history in Marvel Feature Fight. Nice one. And the effect that he sprays out? Oh my god, this is really cool. Now, to meet Miguel O'Hara. Miguel! Our Spider Man. Miguel! Whose powers have been enhanced with the of the future. Spider-Man 29 has acquired a new uniform in T3 Advancement. His passive skills have been strengthened overall compared to his existing uniforms. Let's check out some of those moves real quick here. I'm really a big fan of his He feels so strong, bro. By the movie. How he, he looks. He dodges attacks impressively with his cloning and invisibility skills. His dynamic web shooting moves are actually some of my favorite of the new characters that I've joined here. Alrighty. Okay. His first move is Rake Spin, which causes bleed and stun. Okay. So skill down one more time. Sorry about that. And one more time. A blade is lame, but he he is kind of a vampire. Future trap. Future trap causes stun and fracture. So one more fracture. So he got a BXABL meta ability. Next up, the guys on the left here are going to get a little bit of hologram explosion. Nope. Oh, holograms. Okay, cool. Hologram explosion causes web and paralysis and increases all basic attacks for self. Paralysis and web. Nice. Right, back to these guys down here. Next up, we have Dimension Rip. Dimension Rift it causes burn, stun, and silence, and for yourself, it will recover HP, increase all basic attacks, defense, speed, and crit rate. Okay. And last up, we have Spider Mirage. Let's go to this guy right here. Spider Mirage causes shock, web. Okay, it's the same. The fifth skill, it's exactly the same with the skill he has right now. Increase of critical damage to all basic attacks. One more time. I'm still a big fan of those holograms. All right, let's go ahead and also check out his recommended combos. Oh, he didn't show us the tier three. three. Four and five. Let's go ahead and preview that one more time. Don't want to make any mistakes. Okay, we want the tier three, bro. Sorry, but. Okay. Awesome. Let us know in the chat what you think of Spider Man. 2099. This futuristic spider will harness his advanced technology and abilities for battle. He feels cool. I want to see his tier 3, but yeah. Who would be keeping all the Spider-Men in check during their adventures? 
The elite captain, an expectant mother, is also getting a new uniform. Spider-Woman, who has already had transcendent potential, but her new uniform will make it even more beneficial. I hope we have something with her bike. She looks dope. Okay, she had the leadership for that. straight into it. Her first move is called Spider Stomp. Spider Stomp causes snare. Now okay, all the first skills look so similar on the Spider-Verse characters. Next up, we have Fatal Blow. Okay. Let's try to get a better angle on that one. Fatal Blow causes snare and paralysis. Snare and Paralysis, nice. Next up we have Harsh Punishment. Pulls a giant rock and just slams it. Oh. That feels like an odd skill of a normal Spider-Man. And decreases lightning resistance. Applies itself a chance to grant all damage immunity. Increase all basic attack, defense, and speed. Nice. And next up we have, try to get a good angle here. Enough. Radiation release. Try and get some of those in the back. I don't think those are good. Radiation. One more time. Radiation release causes shock and snare. Yeah, it's, it's like electricity or something. Let's hope for a good bike skill on the fifth skill. The fifth skill got a bike on it, so it's guaranteed. Right. Next up, and lastly, we have veteran biker. Uh, nice. Oh, it's like a Deadpool, the Christmas Deadpool, with the Santa Claus thing, but now it's with a bike and explosions instead of gifts. The dev recommendation is three, five, and four. And once again, let's go ahead and just preview that real quick. Oh, so the fifth skill is cancelable. So you broke on the fourth, and the fifth skill is cancelable. Lame. I'm gonna see the bike. And now, spot. Oh my God, his skills looks dope. Allow me to introduce Spot, who can attack from all directions by using his dimensional spots on his body. Spot will cleverly use the spotted dimension to avoid the attacks of his enemies or move to various locations for surprise attacks. And Spot can be upgraded to a potential transcendence immediately. His attacks will come from everywhere, so enemies will have to keep their eyes peeled. His passive skill is called Confident Surge. It will increase the chain hit damage Increase guaranteed dodge rate, increase skill in bonus damage. His second passive skill is called untouchable. Dodge rate increases and ignores target dodge rate. And his leadership skill, Ignore. teleportation, applies to all allies and gives a dodge and crit rate increase. Let's go ahead and check out his moves, shall we? Dodge and crit for everyone. Weird passive. Everyone is cap these days. Move is called Spot Rush, which causes some stun damage. Okay, pretty basic skill. Go ahead and do that one more time. Next up, we have Surprise Punch, which also causes some stun damage. Using oh, some that's cool! Dropping the punch from the one side and comes out from the other side. Really nice. When defending against an enemy attack, apply stun. Oh, counter attack! In silence, it also <sighs> recovers HP to self, as well as a chance to penetrate super armor, barrier shield, and all damage immune and invincible. He's gonna be a PvP monster. Yes, yes. Next step for these super villains are is punching bag. Oh. Punching bag causes stun, 
paralyzes. Oh my god, his animation is so cool. Alright, next up on the list is Unstoppable Spot. Jumps into that portal. Oh! <laughs> oh my god, his fourth skill and fifth skill is so are so awesome, bro. Increases basic damage. We want his tier 3 also to be so. Spotted Dimension. Let's check this one out real quick. Spotted Dimension is an awakening skill that causes burn and poison. Scorpion will also join in, the, in on the skill attack. Spot skill will position Scorpion in the center. As spot attacks from all sides. Let's go ahead and check Scorpion? Out more time right here in the center and see how we do. He was in the movie, but there's also a ton of buffs that you can check out in the, in the previous one. Tank. <laughs> the tank met again, bro. A tank out of nowhere. Combo recommended. We have three, four, and five for this one. Let's go ahead and check that one out as well. Okay. Feels like a solid combo. And as mentioned before, you can check out the other combo recommendation recommendations in the practice mode. Well, Spot is definitely an elusive supervillain, and can't wait to see him in game. Please let us know in the comments what you think. Okay, I'm super hyped. He's PvP. I'm gonna test him. Timeline battle. Yes. We've covered the exciting Spider-Man across the Spider-Man. That was it. So far. No new content? We've still got more in store for this month's exciting release. More! <laughs> A powerful supervillain, brand new to Marvel Future Fight, will arrive in this June update. A supervillain who threatens all timelines with superior technology Gang. in high intelligence has showed up as a world boss legend. Finally! King the Conqueror! <gasps> who exceeds the power of the former bosses with a difficulty level of 6. <coughs> so those T3, potential transcendent, and T4 heroes that you've all recruited will become integral in your success. Are you ready to face King the Conqueror? Alrighty. What's that symbol here, down? Let's jump right into it. Check out that menacing logo Greed. It's the CTP you could get. Uh, nice. So I'm aware these I would prefer in sight. Speed types and maybe not optimal for the world boss legends. For the sake of showcasing your new heroes, we're gonna go with it. Um, it should also be noted, I am not a pro player, and I'll take any support in the comments and tips and tricks. I'm gonna set some ally teams. It's gonna tell me I'm a little bit too weak for this battle, but we're going in anyway. Gonna go ahead and set up these. Oh my God. Allies I have from <laughs> Kang the Conqueror, bro. <laughs> and he's blast type? Who uses force fields and the ability to travel through dimensions. Kang commands soldiers and utilizes his force field to attack and will even join the fray himself. When his back is up against the wall, Kang will retreat to hidden dimensions and assail with the powers of that dimension. All right, T, ready to get my butt kicked. Let's go. Oh, they have hidden the typing of Spider-Man. You can't see what type is Spider-Man. They have a black symbol and below it's the green symbol of speed. Okay. Okay, nice patterns. He's universal, Kang. You'll never know what attack becomes next. Annoying. Oh, that's the weekend I was waiting for. That was looking cool. Okay, so in 40 bar, it's the first bar that you have to... Okay, 
something happened there. It's hard to understand, to be honest. Okay, he have lost two Spider-Mans and he got only Spider-Woman. Indicators for Kang's choice of attacks when they are transferred to another dimension. Those agents cunning enough to defeat the mighty Kang, the Conqueror can acquire various T3, NT4 materials, growth items, and the mighty CTP of greed. We look forward to your participation in order to maintain the balance of the universe. Oh my god. It's time for what everyone's been waiting for the event coupons. Oh. The coupon code can be used in the main lobby. Screen, go to settings, info, and the coupon for Android users. If you're an iOS and Apple user, check out the coupon registration page in our forum, and there should be a link as available in the chat as well. The coupon code today is Spiderverse. Valid from 612 tonight to 613 tomorrow at 7:59 a.m. PDT. Spiderverse. Should sure that code quickly since it will expire soon. I hope you're as excited as we are for the June update. Be sure to follow our social media channels and forums for everything Marvel Future Fight. Goodbye, everyone. 3RL signing off. See you next time. Oh my god, it was really nice. It was really nice, bro. It was really nice. Oh my god, we're getting Kang, bro. And Spot looks so dope. Spot looks so dope, bro. He is... His symbol there feels like he's agility. Feels like Spot is agility. I mean, speed type. But I'm not 100% sure. They have covered the symbol on his name. But, bro. Bro. This is awesome. This is so awesome. We're getting, we're getting Kang the Conqueror. And Kang the Conqueror fight feels really nice, to be honest. Uh, let's let's see a bit more. Let's see a bit more here. The start, uh, and okay, there is these waves that he's doing. You need to avoid. Uh, there is a little thing going on. I'm not sure. Okay, feels like gore. Feels like Jean. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, I'm looking forward to see that so badly, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I, I'm so hyped. I'm so hyped. And it's added here. It, it's uh, World Boss Legend Kang. And I'm looking forward to see the new characters, how how better they're going to be. Uh, but uh, most of all, I want to see Spot so badly. I mean, the dude has a counter attack on his third skill with penetration and all this stuff. The guy was reading the the skills, so he got a counter attack with penetration. Spot is going to be in the spot for PvP, and that's something that I really enjoy. And the fact that he said his passive ability got Guardian critical, a uh, Guardian uh, dodge rate, and all this stuff makes him valuable, you know, for a situation like Spider-Man uh, supporting him or something. Sorry, the Legend Two. Right now, I can't. And oh my God, how badass Miguel O'Hara was look like. He was looking like so, so bodybuilder. <laughs> oh my God, oh my God. And Spider-Woman fifth skill with uh, bike there. Oh my God, I'm so hyped. I'm so hyped about this update. Don't forget to comment, uh, to go and find and put the Spider-Verse coupon. Also, there is a giveaway I'm doing in my channel. Yesterday, I dropped a video, go there, follow the things that you need to do. It's pretty much answering a quiz of two questions. It's really easy questions and the answers you have to drop in the comments so you can get some coupons yourself uh, for crystals. I'm not sure what Spider-Verse is giving right now. Basically, you know what? Let's go and figure out. Okay, for me it was a hero chest, five star, and it's you have to go and put your member ID also while you're doing that to get the code. 
so yes, it's only a five star uh, um, character, but still, still a reward is a reward. So don't miss the reward. Don't miss the rewards I'm giving away through my Discord. So go down below in the description for the given uh, for the coupon that I'm giving away through the quiz and the coupon that I give away uh, weekly from my Discord. So yeah, stay tuned for crystals and let me know down below in the comments for what stuff are you hyped more? Oh my God, Spot going to be a PvP monster? Oh my God! And yes, I feel like. Everything, everything looks dope. All the characters, everything. Uh, I'm looking forward to play, test, and review it for you guys. Okay, so I, I am so hyped. So yeah, see you into the next and having a nice day. I hope you enjoyed my reaction there. And kisses in your faces.